Yo, what's up guys? Today I'm going to give you some free picks in the NFL preseason as well as the Canadian Football League on prize picks. And we're going to talk a little bit about college football, guys. Yes, that is right. College football is coming back this weekend. And you guys don't know how excited and happy it makes me to be able to say that. We are going to absolutely crush it this football season. We have some extremely profitable strategies that I'm going to be talking about in this video. So for the first pick, we have Anthony Richardson to go less than 75 and a half passing yards. Guys, if you've been paying attention to the Colts lately and the whole situation around Anthony Richardson, he has not been throwing the ball at all this preseason. He has thrown the ball a total of two times. Honestly, I don't know why this line is set to 75 and a half. It's pretty confusing. I'm not gonna think too much about it. I'm gonna go ahead and go less. Guys, if you look up Anthony Richardson's stats in the preseason, he has thrown a total of two completions four attempts, and 25 yards. He does just run. So, of course, I'm not going to take him over this line. I'm going to go ahead and take him under. It's a no-brainer. So, for our second pick, we have Chris Oladokun to go more than 83 and a half passing yards. Again, this is a no-brainer, guys. The Kansas City Chiefs, their death at wide receiver goes. Patrick Mahomes, obviously. Carson Wentz is the backup. And then this guy, Chris Oladokun, is the third string. Obviously, they're not going to play Patrick Mahomes, right, in the last game of the season. They've already shut him down. They're not going to play Carson Wentz, right? They're not going to risk having their backup quarterback get hurt. So the third string, he's probably going to get three quarters, if not the whole game. And if he can't get more than 83 and a half passing yards in three quarters, obviously the wide receivers in preseason games, they like to show out. So honestly, this is a really, really good slip that I'm feeling pretty good about. You guys should lock this in for like half a unit. I'm running half a unit on this one. My unit size is around $100. So yeah, I'm feeling good about that one. So for our second pick, we have the Canadian Football League. We have a correlation slip. We've been doing this all season long, guys. If you guys are new here, we've been absolutely tearing it up in the CFL. We had a cold streak last week because Bo Levi Mitchell, one of the quarterbacks that we bet on, he actually got benched and that ruined two of our 10X slips. We would have cashed out for over 20 units and swept the board. But guys, we've still been killing it in the Canadian Football League. We've been using this strategy called correlation where essentially we just choose a quarterback and a wide receiver to both go over or under their passing yards. In this case, we're choosing under. We got Nathan Rourke to go less than 272 and his receiver, Justin McCannis, to go less than 65. This is a no-brainer. This guy's played in one game. I don't know why his line is set to 272. For some reason, they like to inflate the lines on quarterbacks when they're playing in their first game. I don't know why, but I'm taking it less. Could they go over? Yeah, of course. But mathematically speaking, it makes sense to correlate this wide receiver with the quarterback. Why? Because if the quarterback goes under, the wide receiver is probably going to go under too. So we're doing the same thing with this stack here. Cody Fajardo, more than 291 passing yards. He's playing for Montreal. They're playing against Edmonton. And then we have his receiver, Cole Spiker. We don't hear a lot about him, but he's been silently putting up pretty good numbers. He's been hovering around that like 50, 60, 70 yards per game um, line. So we're taking them both to go over in this game. And guys, I have checked these lines against all the sports books. Check them against FanDuel, Underdog Fantasy. We're getting the max value on these slips, guys. So don't worry. You are in good hands. When I send out these slips in my Discord, I can give you the max value and the max correlation. So this second CFL slip we have, we have Trevor Harris. Again, less his passing yards and Samuel Amillis to go less than his receiving yards. Again, same thing, correlating the wide receiver with the quarterback. And we're getting good line value compared to FanDuel and other sports books. And then lastly, we have Zach Kolaros to go more than 280 and Arteria Wilson to go more than 50. Arteria Wilson has also been quietly putting up huge numbers. Sometimes he has games with over 100 receiving yards. I absolutely love this guy. And so I'm feeling really good about these stacks. Again, this is the third uh, slip. This is the second one. And then this is the first one. So now that we're done with the free picks, I want to show you guys something really, really cool that I've been working on. And that is Counter-Strike 2. I've been absolutely killing it on esports lately. And I want to show you guys the strategy that I've been using. So those of you guys who've been rocking with me for a while, you know that I used to do a lot of esports betting on CS2. And I actually took a break because it wasn't really working that well for me anymore. I think prize picks, they started to kind of get sharper on their lines and get smarter when they set the lines. But guys, I figured out a new strategy that has absolutely been cracking the code in CS2. And I've actually been giving out these slips for completely free over the past 48 hours. I literally just started this strategy like two days ago. But guys, I've been giving out these slips for free on my Twitter. You guys should really follow my Twitter if you guys don't already. My Twitter is Derek underscore bets. And I actually give out these slips for completely free. Um, as you can see, I gave out this slip two days ago on the 20th. We had Cyrus, Muya, Giraffe, and Avid to go over. 
And guess what guys, they all went over except for Samuya. I was really, really disappointed that I didn't catch you guys out on this. We had a lot of people tail. I also posted it on my YouTube community. But guys, we've been getting so close. I've only been playing, I've only played like three slips so far, but on every single slip, I've gotten so close. This is the other slip that I played right here. And then I gave out this out for free as well. We had Wrinkle, Forrester, Nikodos, and Jackie. And as you can see, I posted this slip right here above the other one and i had less less more more and guys look what happened these two went less easily and these guys were literally both one kill away from cashing us out on another 10x if they would have gotten one kill each we would have absolutely banged the slip but guys don't worry we're playing the long-term game here it doesn't matter if we miss one slip honestly like i'm way past the point to where a hook like this really affects me honestly it makes me sadder that i didn't get to cash you guys out I don't care that I didn't win, but if you guys want to see the results of our CS2 slips, I used to absolutely kill it in esports, guys. I honestly don't know why I stopped, but guys, I am back. We're going to be playing a lot of CS2, a lot of Call of Duty, and a lot of Valorant, um, sometimes some League of Legends in the Discord. This makes me so excited. We used to absolutely cash out. This is not even all the slips. This is just all that I could fit on one slide i just chose from like some of the wins that i used to screenshot when i used to send them out on my winning slips channel if you guys want to join my discord these are the options um so this is my home page as you can see it's only 49 dollars a month and that's a super cheap price as i'm about to show you when i show you how much money we got we won last night you guys are going to see that's not expensive at all but yeah there's a seven day free trial on the vip discord I do have a free section if you guys want to join. If you, for whatever reason, you don't want to join VIP, I have a free section where you can actually get a free month of the Discord just by signing up for one of these apps. Um, Chalkboard and Sleeper, I've actually partnered with Chalkboard and Sleeper to where if you use my promo code for Sleeper, my promo code is Derek, and my promo code is Derek Betts on Chalkboard. If you guys sign up for one of these apps and just put in 10 bucks, I will give you a free month of the VIP Discord. So guys, that is a great deal, right? Because one month is usually $49. You guys can get, you know, a month for free and you can get a deposit match up to $100. This one is actually not 100, 500 anymore. It's actually 100. But yeah, if you put in 20 bucks, they'll give you 20 bucks. If you put in 50 bucks, they'll give you 50 bucks. So it's a great deal. Sign up for this app using my promo code and just email me. I'll drop my email in the video here. It's also gonna be in the description. It's just beatthesportsbooks at gmail.com. Or you can just message me on Discord. My username is Derek Betts, no underscores, no spaces on Discord. Yeah, just hit me up and show me a screenshot and I will get you a free month in the Discord. I wanna show you guys the absolute clinic that we put on in the Discord yesterday. I gave out five slips for this discount six, six pack. If you guys know anything about sports betting, these discounts every single Wednesday are super profitable. You're basically getting the same payout on something, but with a reduced line. If you guys don't know what that means, don't worry about it. But when these discounts come out, you wanna use every single one of them. And we absolutely took advantage last night. We went three of five for a nice two unit profit. Max Free, Jameson Tallison, less than five and a half strikeouts. Bang, we had Shohei Otani not to get a home run. Kalia Copper, more than 18 and a half points. Bang, then we had Francisco Lindor, more than 0 0.5 hits. He got two hits. Gunnar Henderson, more than 0 0.5 hits. He just had to get one and then bang. And then guys, guess what? We swept on sleeper. I gave out two picks, one of them 3.36X and one of them 3X. And we swept for over, what is this? $43 in profit. So guys, the average member, if you would have tailed all these slips, made over almost $200 in profit, guys, for $50, a $50 investment, $49 for a month. You made almost $200 in profit just from these discounts last night. So guys, obviously it's worth it. If you guys wanna lock in, you know what to do. Go down to the link in the description. If you guys want to get a free month, you know what to do. Use my code Derek or my code Derek Betts on one of these apps. And then just send me an email or just hit me up on Discord and I will get you in for a free month. So I'm going to end the video here, guys. Make sure you guys tell these slips in the NFL and CFL. Oh, there is something I want to show you guys as well. Something that's actually really cool. I've also been playing around with correlating CS2 with college football, and I was actually able to get a 10x payout. So if you guys notice in the CFL, when I build these slips, the payout is, if you wanna see, the payout is, uh, it gets reduced because it's correlated. You see how it's 50 to pay 425, that's an 8.5x payout. 
But if you correlate college football with CS2, I noticed that sometimes you can get a 10x payout. So I sent this on the Discord and we've already banged 50% of it. Now we're just sweating FSU versus Georgia Tech. We have DJ Oligolai, I don't know how to say his name, to go less than his passing yards. And then his wide receiver, Malik Benson, to go less than his receiving yards. So those two things are correlated, obviously. We're just waiting on the stack. And if they both go under, we will bang out for a 10x profit. So this is the kind of stuff that you guys can expect from the Discord. And it's really, really cool. It makes me really happy to find stuff like this and send it out to you guys. We've been absolutely killing it. And I'm sending a lot of volume, a lot of these slips. We also have this golf and CS2 slip in today. But yeah, I don't want to get too into this. You guys know what to do. You guys can join and see everything.